Yo, 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 what's going on, you gospel YouTubers, YouTubers, and journalists, your boy Ray J, coming at you, I cut my head off, with another Basement Boy Productions, keeping with the same mojo of my last videos, today I'm going to do the essence of Thaddeus Tribbett, or Terry Tribbett, you know, he's primarily known as the basis for his brother's group, Todd Tribbett and Great Anointed, but he's played for a whole host of of many other people but the boy is bad and in my opinion he doesn't get talked about enough but the boy is bad and he's dope and he's clever and precise like for real for real he's a genius so i'm just giving you a couple of things you know that you can do that will resemble something that he would does not maybe not know for no but it's in the park it's in the ballpark it, it's an address all right let's go to the throne grace I name your shy, forgive us for all our sins, and continue to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Lord, truly, thank you for life, health, and strength, and the ability, relevance, articulation, our joints. As we go into this lesson, increase our knowledge, wisdom, and understanding, and our skills, and our talents. As we water and plant, continue to give the increase, Lord. In all things, you get all the glory, all the praise, in Shai's name. We pray, amen. The joy of the Lord is our strength, and the peace of God, which passeth all understand it shall keep your hearts and your mind if you have peace and you have joy you're going to make it and when we get out of this if you have peace and joy you're still going to make it you know what i mean so you, if you don't have it ask and it shall be given seek and you shall find knock and the door shall be open i didn't come to preach but i'm just saying if i could just help somebody peace and joy is what we need all right so i'm being f sharp and the song I'm going to show you something on is You Are My Joy. It was the Life album with John P. Key. And the part is when they looped the 736. You know, thank you for your grace and your mercy. Mercy, thank you for your love you give to me. Each trial you have made me glad. I will rejoice that part. So all that is 4371, Six, five, flat five, three, two, five. You just keep repeating it. And that's what he does. All right, so that's the part. So it's something simple, but the placement just makes it sound so freaking crazy. Like, dog, what is that? Like, I remember doing him doing it and hearing it, but when I finally got it, because I had to play the song, I lost my mind. It's like I went to sleep like a kid, you know, knowing you're about to get some of your favorite sneakers because it's your birthday tomorrow, waking up all excited. I said, I can't wait to drop that note. So, four, three, two, one, seven. He does a flat seven, which is the E. And it's a, just think of it as an E major chord, an E and A flat. Flat seven, six. So, instead of going seven, three, six, he did seven, flat seven, six. So, but it doesn't sound good when you keep going low. So you want to, if you're, when you're walking down low, then you go to the flat seven, an octave up. Ooh. All right. Kill it, bro. So whenever you have to play the seven, three, six, drop that in there. So seven, flat seven, six. All right. So another thing that he does, just staying with that, uh, Todd Trivet, a lot of his music, you know, they, because it's a lot of bells and whistles, you know, smoking mirrors and every well, not really smoking mirror. They have like these different changes, but they love their flat notes, like the flat two, flat three, flat five, flat six, flat seven. They play a lot around it, whether if it's like a little quick lick or like a line, they use they utilize those flat notes a lot, and it kind of like gives that music its its uniqueness. All right, so for this lesson, I'm going to be in A flat. All right, and I 
I just played with the flat note. So something that you will hear him do is like whenever they go to like the, let's just say the flat six, if we're in A flat, you will hear something like this. Basically, that same E major chord I did when we were F sharp, which was the flat seven. Now in A flat, it becomes a flat six, and it's an open string. So you will hear them do that a lot. So that's just something over the flat seven. All right. So all that was four flat seven. Flat three, six, flat six, flat seven, one. All right, and you can really make that a lick. Flat seven can be also used as a substitution note or like a, a, a passing chord. So if you were doing like a song like uh let me see. What song can you do? If you just doing like a simple one six two five progression, so to use that in the shout and lick you could do that as well so all right so that would be the lick so one two three four five six seven eight and it utilizes that Mainly that uh, the E major scale, which would, if you want to talk modes, that would be three, four, five, six, the Phrygian mode. But we're in we're in A flat. But that's the Phrygian mode, and it's basically uh, playing it playing an E major scale, but you're in A flat. All right, and that just utilizes that scale, so. There you go. So that would be four, flat seven, flat three, flat six, flat seven, flat three, flat seven, one. And even if you're playing shout music, you could drop that. So. So. And you also drop that flat seven, I mean that flat two in there as well. So hopefully that was uh, helpful. And again, if you don't remember anything else, he plays a around with the like the flat six, the flat seven, well, all your flat notes. And if you just want to keep it simple, how can I remember to play around with all the flat notes? You just, whatever the flat note is, just play that major scale, that major pentatonic scale. So for example, if you want to play around with the flat two. All right, so.
that was just the that was the A major scale. I just did a descending A major scale. So in A that was one, six, five, three, two. And then I went back to A flat. And you could do the same thing when you're on the E. All right, and that's just the E major scale. So that's the back to A flat. If you're in F sharp, I mean, if you want to do the F sharp or the flat seven, and I'm doing it literally the same run. That's just so whatever. I just give you the standard numbers in the major pentatonic. So that would be that's just your literal, you know, major pentatonic two, three, five, six, one, two, three. Where are we at? For even for E. It's the same thing. It's the same form, it's just that major pentatonic using for the flat notes if, if you're doing B. So that's pretty much it. Just wanted to give you some more, you know, insight. So if anything was unclear, just let your boy know and I'll clear it up. As always, continue to comment, like, share, and subscribe. You know, I'll be getting back to y'all. It's your boy Ray J over and out.